details now on a deadly motorcycle crash. It's a story we first brought you as breaking news last night at 11. Police tell us a Barrington man was killed when he lost control of his motorcycle late last night on Route 95 North near the Thurber's Avenue exit in Providence. Eyewitness News reporter Walt Buteau has been working the story. He joins us live now from Providence with the Mobile Newsroom. This happened last night around 9.30. We can take you down to the scene here on Route 95. As you said, right near the Thurber's Avenue exit, the victim was riding motorcycle with two of his friends, all of them on motorcycles. And according to state police, witnesses say all three were speeding. The victim and the motorcycle became airborne, according to state police, ending up on the grassy median on the other side of this 95 North Jersey barrier in the Thurber's Curve area. And state police say 33-year-old Anthony Larissa of Barrington was thrown about 50 feet from Route 95. He was not wearing a helmet and was dead at the scene. That crash eerily similar to this fatal motorcycle crash over the weekend on 95 in Pawtucket. 37-year-old Jamie Marins was ejected from his motorcycle after hitting a Jersey barrier and also was not wearing a helmet. Witnesses in both crashes tell police the riders were speeding. You have to operate your vehicle in a safe, prudent manner. Uh, be aware of your surroundings, aware of the vehicles that are around and about you. Obviously, we encourage you to wear uh, a helmet. And since April, in Rhode Island, this is the fourth fatal motorcycle crash. Live in the Mobile Newsroom in Providence, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.